Hi everyone, it's Whitney. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, you guys, I have a update on this canvas here. This is a canvas that I got several months ago um, from Kuha. They sent me this canvas and I worked on it here and there whenever I was in the mood to work on it because there's several issues with this canvas. So first of all, this is a 50 by 50 centimeters. I do, however, feel that it is on the small side for 50 by 50. I ain't gonna measure it, you guys. Um, I'm just not. But it is a little small, and that's totally fine. The size is not one of the issues that I have with it. So this is the image up in the corner. This is the Mickey and Friends, I guess. That's what I'm calling it, the Mickey and Friends um, diamond painting. And it has 32 colors. So what I will say about this canvas is that it does not look bad, especially on camera. It doesn't look bad at all. It's not bad how it's coming out. I'm loving how it's coming out. I do, however, feel though that 32 colors is way too much for this canvas here. Like it just could have been way less. But then again, I don't know because some canvases requires a lot of colors to give you the look of it and make it look better. So that could be part of the reason why it has so many but I'm just not feeling it and I don't have that much left so most of the top part um well the top part is a lot more than the bottom that I have left so I have just these two rows here so hopefully I can get it done fairly quickly come on here and show you guys the review um one of the main issues I have again like I said is the colors it's just too many for me it's just I feel like it should be less and then the canvas is kind of wrinkly. I've laid it flat. It did get flat. However, it's still kind of wrinkled and I don't like that. It also came and it was very dirty. So I don't know if you guys can see all this right here. This is not from me at all. It was dirty when it came. So kind of not happy with that. And one of the major issues that I have with this canvas here is the guide circles. I used to not really care when I started diamond painting about guide circles, but now I, however, do feel like you can see them through the canvas. And I don't know if you guys can actually see them. You may not be able to, but there's certain sections where I can see the guide circles. So I don't like that. And then some of the um, symbols on the canvas are a little ashy so they're kind of faded and they're hard to see so this is one of those canvases when I'm working on it I make sure that I have my light pad obviously you know I use the light pad all the time but a lot of the symbols I cannot see with the light pad so I'm having to turn the light pad off so that is another issue why I wasn't able to get it done as fast as I would like to because I'm having to work on this during the daytime now, I've said it before and I'll say it again. I love to work on my canvases at night, especially the big ones because my son is sleeping. It's just easier. Like during the day, you know, I can get a little one done easily, but I like these bigger ones to be at night. And the symbols being hard to read is a huge issue. I'm no quitter though, so I am going to definitely finish the canvas because I do like how it does look. It doesn't look bad. I have another canvas from them. That is, I believe, Jason Voorhees from the scary movie Jason. It has guide circles on it as well, but I'm definitely going to finish that canvas too. And then after that, I'm not dealing with guide circles anymore, you guys. I do have several canvases that I ordered from AliExpress. When I first started diamond painting and those do have guide circles, I, however, will be working on those, you know, whenever at my leisure, whenever I feel like it. But as far as me working with companies that have guide circles, I just cannot do it. It's just, it's something about it. And then the concentrate with your eyes, it's just, my eyes are not working correctly with that. So I'm just saying that is what is going on with this canvas here. I, however, do like Kuha. I have a video that I did recently unboxing from them. So they have updated their um, canvases their rendering is a lot better. Well, it, it is better. Their rendering is better, their canvases are better, and their symbols are clear on their canvases. So I'm always here for a company that has made improvements and they absolutely have. So that is one of the main reasons why I'm gonna make sure I finish this canvas as well as the Jason one that I have. So 
there you have it you guys i just want to give you guys a quick update on this canvas i try to come on here when i'm working on large canvases to give you guys a update so that you know i am working on them so yeah hopefully i can get this one done soon and then get back on here and show it to you guys all completed but that is it you guys for this video do not forget to like comment and share my videos you guys most importantly hit that subscribe button and i will talk to you all in my next video bye